Yo, what's going on guys? This is Vilshu here. Um, I'm here to uh, tell you all how to get blocks trapped and use fast flags. So, um, might as well get right into it, yeah? So we're gonna go to Google and you're gonna wanna type up uh, block trap. I'll put this in the description for you so you don't even have to worry. There's a lot of fake websites that are uh, uh, tricking people and it's putting viruses on the computer. But this is the real one because it's by Pizza Boxer. So uh, when you open the link to the GitHub, uh it might be confusing to you but you're just gonna scroll down here until you see installing right here you're gonna click uh latest release of block shop it'll be blue there and it'll send you to this uh which current version is 2.7.0 um and then you scroll all the way down here till you see block shop v 2.7.0.exe and then um download that it'll pop up in the right and then once you download that it'll pull up the block shop menu which would be this um it won't look exactly like this. i mean it will look exactly like this but it'll say install for me it says save because i already have it but um basically you can do anything here like enable activity tracking it'll show uh what game you're playing on what's it called discord um you can do this you can do this i mean it's all just preference really um i don't really do much um in the mods this isn't modding like cheating um this is like modding your browser like use old death sounds so whenever someone dies say in play ball um it's the oof sound it's not like the i don't even know the sound now um mouse cursor you can change um but i do a different way of changing my mouse cursor and i'll tell you all about that later on um so yeah just scroll through whatever you want you can even do custom fonts if you want um fast flags that's going to be the one that you pay attention to mostly uh, you have anti-aliasing quality, disable player shadows, disable post-processing, disable terrain textures. All I have is these two disabled, and I have this on four times. Um, frame rate limit, um, this is pretty self-explanatory. It's uh, uncapping from 240, which is what the, I think the max is on a normal browser. I set mine to uh, 135K, but that's because of my fast flags, which I will get into soon. Um, lighting technology, I have on Voxel 1. Um, that's also because of my fast flags, but you can change this to like chosen by game. So it might like the Vox one might make a make a certain game inside Roblox buggy. But I mean, I personally haven't ever experienced any uh, lighting issues or bugs. So, um, yeah, you can change your rendering texture. I leave that on automatic. I don't really mess with it. Um, you can change your font size if you want. But, you know, this is all this is all normal. But the one that you're going to be interested in is this right here. Fast flag editor. Now, when you first open it, it's going to like warn you. It's going to be like, are you sure you know what you're doing? You can just click. Yeah, obviously, we know what we're doing here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But um, uh, I'm not giving you all anything that's going to like break your game. And honestly, if you do get someone's fast flags that like maybe crashes your game, you can just go and delete it and your game will be perfectly fine. But um. I have multiple versions of um, like lists like this right here that I use. Um, depending on the game, I mainly play play ball and rivals, but like mainly play ball. Um, so I of course used to use a uh, texture one where it would like uh, change the colors. It would be darker and the textures would be all smooth. My character would be glossy. Um, but right now I'm just using ping optimizer and uh, gray sky and a different um, a different pause mini type of thing like different um, GUI. And that would be right here, the Lua app system bar. I'll show you all that um, whenever I load into a game. But yeah, all of this MTU size you can find if you go to your command prop, uh, prompt. Sorry, And um, I'll put what you need to type in down in the description. And then you can just find your command prompt. What am I saying? You can find your uh, MTU size. Mine is 1500, but when I put 1500, it like breaks the game a little bit. So I'll put 1472 and it's perfect. Um, the rest of this, I'm going to be honest, I'm not too sure what it does. But I do know that it works because it personally it works for me. It brings my ping down by like 60 um and like any other game you know i have like 10 to 20 ping but roblox it's wild you know um so yeah once you finish doing all of your fast flags um you can click install for me it's save of course but for you it'll be installed um or you could keep looking like create desktop icon um automatically update blog shop which of course you do one on uh installation i guess it'll tell you how to uninstall it if you ever want to uninstall it but um yeah so uh, that's all that when you get that done you can go ahead and launch it it'll be uh it'll say play roblox it will not be the roblox player so remember that if you do want to play normal roblox of course you can go back up to roblox player and you can play that it won't be anything like the um it won't have any of the fast flags so you want to go ahead and launch this it'll open up you'll already be signed in so don't even worry it's just replacing the roblox player um so for me you see i have a different um 
mouse cursor but i will show you that if you all want to know that just let me know down in the comments um i'll make a tutorial on that a lot of people have made tutorials but they're very very confusing i'll make one that's pretty simple for you all um yeah so let's go ahead and load into blade ball real quick um and i'll just show you all okay so as i'm recording too uh let's see i'm pulling 250 260 270 frames right now normally it's 280 it goes really fast but i'm basically pulling 280 right now so uh, yeah if you want to check that you can um do shift or well f and shift f5 depending on if you have a 60 percent keyboard or not if not just press f5 um but yeah this is what the game looks like you know there's no shadows there's no player shadows um this you can make dark with the other fast legs that i was telling you about but i mean if you all want that i'll just send you a link down there uh you can also check out nifty's video uh he made a very very good in-depth video about it now there is like highlighted right here but like you can remove that with uh some fast flags if you would like but honestly it doesn't really matter um just depends on the preference of course um i'll go ahead and put a link to my discord too um i'm gonna make a channel for all the fast flags that i use and all the fast flags that known people have made that work and uh definitely fix ping fix fps all of that i can make a tutorial on how to like properly set up a fast flag yourself like a whole list of it if you don't want to like copy and paste someone's random one you can't figure out like what the problem is with the uh, with like why texture is different or something like that but yeah so basically that would be the video guys thank you all for watching let me know if you have any questions uh in the comments i'll link my discord in there you can join up get the fast flags ask me some questions personally and uh yeah it's been bill i'll see you guys